BYD, which actually delivered over 274,000 vehicles for the month, is currently their main rival. Comparing this to last year, there has been a 57.5% increase. It's crucial to remember that BYD concentrates on selling hybrid automobiles. The statistics is currently skewed in China, since hybrid cars are occasionally combined with either pure electric vehicles or BEVs, battery electric vehicles. These two data points are combined, since most people who purchase hybrid cars do so mainly for the electric part of the vehicle because they live in densely populated areas. These figures are so added together. Tesla is still better than BYD in terms of profit margins per vehicle, but not in terms of pure volume delivered. Tesla is a business whose cutting-edge goods and services have completely transformed the car industry. Three key pillars support its business model, its charging network, servicing, and direct sales. Tesla can generate value for its consumers and shareholders thanks to these pillars, which also provided a competitive edge over its rivals. In this video, we go into a fascinating subject and examine a crucial element that may have a big impact on Tesla's price. This is the debut of Tesla's most amazing car to date, one that has the potential to drastically alter the company's landscape and put it in a competitive position. Kevin Green joins us to talk about Tesla, a recurring topic on this program, especially in relation to EVs and Tesla. Kevin Green, our senior markets journalist, is here to discuss the future of electric vehicles with us. The journal claims that their capacity to grow their charging stations may eventually turn into a key component of their company's operations. It is one of Tesla's fastest growing segments, and for good reason. In comparison to its rivals, Tesla is able to obtain federal grant awards for energy storage and charging stations at a cost that is almost 50% lower. They think that these charging stations' building expenses are more economical than those of their rivals, which might potentially be advantageous for Tesla. Government support is typically a reliable source of income for companies, thus Tesla stands to benefit greatly from this growth. A futuristic electric pickup truck with the potential to completely transform the automobile industry is called the Cybertruck. When it was first launched in November 2019, its unique look, outstanding performance, and cutting-edge features garnered a lot of attention. Three variants with varying battery sizes, motor combinations, and ranges are anticipated from Cybertruck. With a single motor and rear-wheel drive, the standard model can travel 250 miles. A tri-motor all-wheel drive system with a 500-mile range powers the top-of-the-line model, while a two-motor all-wheel drive system powers the mid-range variant. Welcome back to Tesla tomorrow, everyone. Not only is Tesla's business model successful, but it is also enduring. The company's goal is to hasten the global switch to sustainable energy by manufacturing solar panels, batteries, electric cars, and other clean energy products. Not only are Tesla products fun to drive, but they are also safer and more intelligent than traditional cars. These vehicles are outfitted with cutting-edge technology like autopilot and fully autonomous driving, which improve comfort and convenience for both drivers and passengers. They also have the best safety ratings in their class. Tesla has a scalable and flexible business plan. With innovative products and services like the RoboTaxi, Powerwall, Roadster, Cybertruck, Semi, and Solar Roof, the company is always coming up with new ideas. We'll be concentrating on the Cybertruck in this video. Before we begin, please click the like button, subscribe, and enable post alerts if you enjoy this kind of information so that you may be informed about any updates regarding Tesla. Let's examine a few of the Tesla Cybertruck's features. It features an adjustable air suspension system, an over 14,000 pound towing capacity, and a payload capacity of up to 3,500 pounds. The vehicle's exoskeleton is made of stainless steel and is impervious to rust, dents, and scratches. It also features a tunnel cover that can hold a person's weight and secure storage area up to 100 cubic feet. Six passengers may fit in the Cybertruck's roomy cabin with ease, and there is more room for storage beneath the second row seats. It has a 17-inch touchscreen that manages different functions throughout the car thanks to a personalized user interface. Furthermore, there are other uses for the compressed air and onboard power outlets. 
Delivery of the Cybertruck were scheduled for the end of Q3 2023, with production slated to begin in the middle of 2023. The global chip shortage, the COVID-19 pandemic, the building of the Texas factory where the Cybertruck will be built, design modifications, and the regulatory approvals needed for the vehicle have all caused multiple delays to the production timeline. Other electric pickup trucks are a competitor in the market as well. It is anticipated that Tesla's demand and market share in the automotive sector would be significantly impacted by the Cybertruck. Customers anxious to acquire the car have already placed over a million reservations for it. It is anticipated to appeal to a broad spectrum of consumers, seeking a vehicle that is powerful, adaptable, environmentally friendly, and performs well in a variety of situations. The dominance of conventional pickup trucks in the American market, such the Ford F-150, the best-selling car in the country, is also anticipated to be challenged by the Cybertruck. It will increase Tesla's market share in international regions where pickup trucks are less common than in the United States, including as Europe and Asia. Long-term sales and profitability for Tesla, along with brand awareness and its reputation for innovation, will all increase with the Cybertruck. Investor and Tesla supporter Kathy Wood previously discussed her thoughts on the Cybertruck, saying she has examined it from a variety of perspectives and thinks it is superior to all other vehicles. She asserts that there is no comparable model between the Cybertruck and the Ford F-150. Since Tesla can create its own batteries and is cutting its overall cost in creating EVs, Wood highlighted that the Cybertruck will be a strong competitor to the Ford F-150. Wood went on to clarify that other manufacturers of electric vehicles will have to offer their own vehicles at a loss or at a higher price. Brent Winton, a fellow Tesla enthusiast, stated in his tweets that Tesla is producing game-changing profits in car categories where conventional manufacturers are struggling to stay afloat. He went on to say that Tesla might decide to go with comparable margins for trucks and force all of its established domestic rivals onto its Cybertruck blade. Although Tesla assumed an engineering risk for the Model X as well as the Cybertruck, Winton clarified that the risk associated with the exoskeleton of the Cybertruck is related to the vehicle's fundamental cost and performance features. Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, has stated that after years of waiting, the Cybertruck may soon be ready for consumer purchase. The Cybertruck, according to Musk, is not just the best car Tesla has ever made, but it may also be the greatest product ever created. The vehicle's 2019 launch was not without problems or criticism, but the publicity around it has been very effective. Within a week of the Cybertruck's release, Musk said, at the time that Tesla had received over 250,000 bookings for the truck. With the Cybertruck, however, that wasn't the case. Even during the pandemic, some Tesla outlets were receiving hundreds of Cybertruck bookings every week. Normally, Tesla receives a large number of reservations shortly after an announcement, which then taper off. A lot of attention was also focused on the Cybertruck production program because this car is predicted to have a big long-term impact on the pickup truck and EV markets. Cybertruck pre-orders, which have reached absurd heights since the vehicle's unveiling, significantly increased sales. Regarding Tesla's Cybertruck, what is your opinion and how do you think sales of the vehicle will impact Tesla's stock price going forward? Please share your thoughts with us below and don't forget to share your Tesla valuation with us. Click on the next video that appears on your screen to find out more about Tesla's recent activities. I'll see you over there. Let's return to Tesla's valuation now. Kathy Wood is correct when she says that throughout the past two years, Tesla's stock has underperformed in comparison to the S&P 500. The stock still has a lot of room to rise in the future, though. Tesla's business will be driven by the anticipated explosion in the market share of electric vehicle sales. Kathy Wood's investment approach is centered on spotting and funding disruptive innovation, of which Tesla is one example. Due to Tesla's success, the car industry has been completely appended and the public's opinion of electric vehicles has changed, moving them from being considered niche products to viable options. Other manufacturers have accelerated their own electric endeavors as a result of this influence, which has made Tesla a significant draw for investors like Kathy Wood.
She emphasized in a recent interview why Tesla's distinct competitive edge in the EV industry will help the company's future gross margin and stock price. When its plans are carried out correctly, Tesla has a great potential to rule the sector. It is now ranked highly. Tesla's competitive advantages are increasing. Notably, seeing the necessity of this infrastructure, GM and Ford have committed to using Tesla's charging stations. This has raised trust in Tesla's management. It is evident that internal combustion engines are giving way to electric vehicles, and Tesla is ideally positioned to benefit from this change because to its well-established EV DNA. In terms of valuation, Tesla is almost ready to launch a nationwide network of autonomous taxis. Due to developments in artificial intelligence, Tesla drivers who have the most recent SAD, full self-driving, version in beta may see noticeable improvements. Tesla is a leader in the transition to an electric and more sustainable mode of transportation thanks to its dedication to innovation, sustainability, and customer happiness. In order to appreciate Kathy Wood's viewpoint, one must comprehend disruptive innovation, which denotes novel. Technologies, goods, or services that append established incumbents in order to significantly change an existing market. Beyond just building electric vehicles, Tesla has completely redesigned the automotive industry as well as the customer experience. The traditional auto business relies on suppliers, whereas Tesla uses a vertical integration method that involves producing numerous components in-house. Tesla makes sure that its customers' cars stay state-of-the-art long after they buy them by integrating software that allows for over-the-air updates inside the vehicle. Regardless of the state of the economy, businesses who have a competitive advantage in innovation will prosper, according to Kathy Wood. Investors are reassured by Tesla's profitability by its remarkable track record of innovation. Tesla's foray into the electric vehicle EV, market is a shining example of disruptive innovation, appending the established quo of conventional automakers. In an effort to keep up with Tesla, rivals have stepped up their electric endeavors, which has caused a wider trend toward electric vehicles. With products like Powerwall and Solar Solutions, Tesla has an impact not just on the automotive industry, but also on the energy sector. The company's goal of hasseting the global switch to renewable energy sources includes its battery business. Given its competitive advantage in battery technology and its investments in research, development, production, and battery recycling, Tesla's battery business is expected to generate substantial revenues and profits in the future. With its electric vehicles, Tesla is redefining the automotive industry and standing out from the competition thanks to its dedication to innovation and sustainability. Tesla's prospective customer base grows along with its global reach, laying the groundwork for long-term, sustainable growth. Strategically placed gigafactories enable Tesla to effectively enter new markets by lowering production and delivery costs and leveraging local demand. Tesla has proven over the years to have strong sales growth and increased profitability while being a relatively new business. How do you feel? Please share your thoughts with us in the space provided, and don't forget to value Tesla. Click on the next video that appears on your screen to find out more about Tesla's recent actions. I'll see you over there.